Oh lordy. This is where a baby cart is. The baby cart. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Oh yeah, buddy. You getting your exercise in the day. You guys got the back right Uh-huh. <laughs> Thanks, Jordan. Frisky. Blaine. You got the uh the Deerfield scooter there? First trip out. Nice. Love it. I think I'm losing my bait pretty quickly out there. So I'm gonna put a piece of shrimp flavored fish bites on here also. So that way, if I lose my cut mullet, at least I still got something on the hook. What's going on fishing buddies? Welcome back to the channel. Red October, big bull reds are here. Big bull reds are starting to show up in Alabama. This happens once a year, they come running through. We'll get about two weeks of them before they before they pass. But it's an absolute blast. We start talking about it like in August. <laughs> Everybody starts getting ready. And the boys are out today. Let's get it out there. Tons of birds working out there. They are just attacking something. You got Mr. Perdido Blaine over What's here. up, dog? All the boys are out today. Sean Lawless. What's you guys up? check out his channel, The Lawless Tide. I am using the new tubular spikes from Deerfield Fabrication. These just go straight in. The way they have this angled is a great design. There's, I mean, literally no work to get these sand spikes in. I like using these completely closed sand spikes when I'm fishing for bigger fish because sometimes they will hit it and not commit and it'll bounce your rod back out. So when you have those open face sand spikes like I usually use, my rod will hit the sand. So when I'm fishing for big guys, I like to use these tubular ones. Just picked these up a few days ago from Deerfield. They have not disappointed. All these birds are coming right for our lines. <laughs> We gotta pull them up. I mean, it's just, it's gonna happen. One's gonna get caught in this line. Let's not fish for a minute. I'll show you my setup real quick. I am using the 12 foot Frisky Fins Custom. This is on a Ninja Dagger Blank. 5000 series pin battle three, 30 pound true braid. I got a single drop 40 pound leader here. One little bead, uh, size four circle hook, fish bites, cut mullet. Weight on bottom. Second setup, identical from the first. Oh, and Frisky's on over there. Frisky is on. I'm definitely getting some bait out. I had them up because of the birds. But it looks like it's about to be on. Yeah, buddy. Nice rod bend on that guy. Is that a mullet? Ooh, taking him down the beach. Don't let him whoop you down, Frisky. Do what I can. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. G2 Coastal, what's up, buddy? Well, you know, all the boys are out this morning. Yeah, does Frisky's. nobody work? Yeah, <laughs> I pulled in. It's no. Thursday morning. Yeah, there's like a hundred people. Yeah, I quit. Wait, work. Nobody has a job. I quit work about eight months ago. <laughs> you gonna get this thing in, bro? Try. Oh no! Oh, oh bird. Bird. Sean thought he was on, but he bird. might be on a bird. Double up on pelicans. All right, we got Jax. <laughs> we're, le we're leaving Frisky. <laughs> he can fend for himself. Ugh. Get the bummy stick. Uh, uh, got one tied on. Oh yeah, buddy. I wanna go catch him. <laughs> He's off. Sean's hooked up. All right, all right. Get him, buddy. Oh, triple hookup, triple hookup, quadruple hookup. Come on. Sean, Sean and Jordan are on. Frisky's still fighting that fish. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Woo, Woo, buddy. Sean's right. still hooked up on his. Yeah. Complete madness going on here. And then we got Jordan's buddy still hooked up over here. Woo. Yes. 
Nice. Hell yeah. That was worth a three hour trip. Frisky finally got a stingray off. <laughs> He's going to chase him. Here they are again. Here they are again. Oh yeah. Come on. They are right, right on the beach, man. I gotta get in front of Frisky. You got him? Yeah, Frisky's hooked up. Come on. Come on. They're right here. They're right here. Come on. I did a parallel cast. They are right up on the beach. Oh, it's a big shark. They still gotta be around. Whew. Come on, all right, I put this one deep. I'm not seeing them bust up close anymore. Oh, I see him. That's a jack, buddy. Adam, with the big boy red. No, that's a jack. <laughs> Woo. On the top water popper. Just monster after monster. There we go. There we go. All right. Yeah. That's what I wanted to feel, baby. Oh, oh no. That's what I wanted to feel. Oh, got to make sure I got this guy hooked. Ah. Yeah. On the bubby stick. Uh. Hold tight. Uh. Oh, he's coming in. No, that's Adam's lure. Uh. All right, battery. Don't go dead. Turned. He took a run. Oh, he took a run. 4,000 series reel. I got 20 pound true braid on this. 10 foot bummy stick powered by Ninja Tackle. I caught him on an ounce and a half ES lure, pink and gold. And I got 40 pound fluorocarbon leader on here. So I gotta be careful with this guy. Gotta be careful with him. Woo, that's a nice reel you got there, buddy. Yeah, I can dunk it in the sand and <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna need a. Oh, Adam's got a phone. All right. All right, he's getting close. He's getting close to getting mad again. He's getting mad again. This bummy stick by Ninja Tackle is a great rod for this, for casting lures for big fish. That's what it was actually designed to do but I mainly use them for set rig fishing because they're great 10 foot rods for the panhandle. That's a perfect little size for the panhandle. So that's what I use them for. But I knew I was coming out here today. I knew there might be an opportunity to cast some metal at these big fish. So I rigged this guy up to prepare and I'm glad I did. Come on. With the assist. Oh, that's a nice one, buddy. Let me uh let me get this rod and reel situated. I don't want to get that guy in the sand. I'm not frisky. Alright, buddy. Huge Oh no! Oh no! You ain't going nowhere. You ain't going nowhere. Stop! Stop! Uh, uh. This guy's heavy. Get a picture. On the ES lure, guys. He smashed it. Hooked him perfect right there in the corner of the mouth. Oh. Monster fish, guys. That's what we came here for, baby. Alabama. Red October. All the big fish are running around. Woo! Uh, I brought the waders with me this morning. First time of the season I had them out. Oh, just for situations like this. There he goes. Whoo, those are hardy fish, man. That guy fought for a while. 
As soon as I put him in the water, he took off. That was an absolute blast. Whew. That made getting up at 4 a.m. well worth it. My set rigs have been out for like a half an hour, unattended. I do not recommend that. Something might be on here. Absolute chaos. Everybody hooked up. Everybody landed them. Woo! That will wear you out. It was like 42 degrees this morning. I am hot. It's waders, jackets, Woo. gloves. Get some of this live bait from Frisky, get some set rigs out, have a snack. I was regrouping and my buddy Adam's rod ran off. Set rig. We got something on here for sure. It's a big one. He don't want to come up. Tighten the drag down on him a bit. I gain a little on him and he takes it right back out. Come on. Frisky's coming with the assist. I got the waders on. You want to switch? Oh, here he comes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Thanks, buddy. No Absolute stud, guys. Woo. I'm tired. Beast of a red, guys. Woo, that guy fought. They're running through right now. I'm seeing other anglers down the beach hooked up. We're gonna get this guy released. See if we can get on another one. Woo! Turning out to be a good day. Jordan got his on the beach. Woo! I've been doing more running today. Yeah, buddy. There we Woo. go. There we go. Get, get it, it, buddy. Ah! Get it. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Uh, no? 